What is going on, everybody? This is SDoc21, welcoming you to my YouTube channel. That's a pretty fancy intro you got right there, isn't it? Mm -hmm. What is going on? Everybody, this is SDoc21, welcoming you back to Pokemon Fire Red Let's Play. In last episode, we got caught halfway through this battle against the Cool Trainer. So in this episode, we are going to finish it off. I don't know if we're going to be able to battle the gym leader because there are still two more trainers that I want to battle because that's free XP. Why would I battle the gym leader first? Because then the trainers become inactive. So I'm going to battle everybody in here and try to get Growlithe up in level. After beating everybody, Growlithe should be somewhere around level 26 or 27, which will put him on par with Eevee. So it's all gonna work out in the end, and we're just gonna <clears throat> we're just gonna keep pushing on through. Sorry I cleared my throat again. I don't know what happened, but all of a sudden I've gotten a bunch of junk up in my throat. And I think it's because I've been recording yesterday and today. So it's a lot of stress on my vocal cords to keep talking for this long. Like I have to talk for a 10 minute long thing and I don't just record one episode at a time. I end up recording like four or five on good days. I'll record like 10 or 20. Like today, uh, this will be my seventh recording, I believe. Yes, yes, this will be my seventh recording of this session. So that's 70 minutes of just me talking. And I mean, I, I drink in between videos like drink water, not, yeah, you get it. I drink water, that way my vocal cords are, are nice and watered up, but that's still a lot of time to talk and, and keep going. Like I only get like a two minute break in between each video and then I'm speaking again for the next one because that's how I'm gonna be most effective with my time and that's why I get stuff in my throat is because 70 minutes of talking nonstop is a lot on your body. Why don't you try it? Seriously, just just talk for 10 minutes and then get a little bit of a drink and then start talking again for 10 minutes and you can't stop. You have to keep going. You can take a couple of second pause like there was one time in one of the videos uh, there were bells going on outside because the, the college does that and I was like, oh, can you guys hear that? Can you hear it? And then I paused for like four or five seconds and I doubt anyone could hear it, but I mean I could so that's why I said something about it, but it's a lot of time talking, so yeah, <clears throat> it's pretty rough on the vocal cords, but you just gotta keep rolling with it, you know? It's all live, it's all getting done, it's all getting put up on YouTube, and it's all for your guys' enjoyment, right? I mean, that's why I ask questions in the videos. It, that way you guys can answer it and actually talk to me, instead of it just being, I'm some YouTuber, I actually want to be someone that you can relate to instead of just some person on YouTube. Like, I know a lot of people out there watch big channels that have a couple million subscribers, and they don't respond to their comments anymore. Which, it makes sense, if you're getting, you know, 30,000 comments a day, you can't respond, but... I only have <clears throat> 236 subscribers as of right now, so I can definitely... Dang. Alright, I can definitely respond to your comments, so... Leave your comments down below, and I'll talk to you. I mean, if it's just something simple, like great video, Estac. I really enjoyed it. I'll be like, well, thank you so much, because it really does mean a lot. You're gonna really... You're gonna use sleep powder? I just want to get this battle done with, man. What are you doing to me? <laughs> Alright, hopefully I'll wake up next turn. Because <clears throat> I really want to get Eevee the XP if I'm not getting it to growl it. Oh, goodness. There we go. Eevee woke up. Solid work, Eevee. Go down. Yes! Alright. 664 XP, that's quite a bit there for Eevee. I have a couple of low-level Pokemon, and I will be getting another one, as I said in previous videos. I will be getting another Pokemon in this city. That's right, it, <laughs> sorry, I hit the button. I didn't mean to do that. I will be getting it in the city. Not in a, a patch of grass somewhere, but in the city. So what could I be talking about, guys? If you know what I'm talking about. Let me know in the comment section down below, and if you don't know what I'm talking about, go check out my last couple of videos because I've talked about it in each of them. Talked about getting another Pokemon who's going to be level 18 that goes through two evolutions. 
before I get the final. I guess since I've been talking about it a bunch, I will give you one more hint, and that's it. I'm done giving hints at this point, okay? Your big hint right here is this Pokemon is a pseudo-legendary. It's just like Arcanine, where it's not a legendary, but it kinda... I keep hitting that button, sorry guys. But it kinda should be because it's so much stronger than the average Pokemon. So if you don't know what I'm talking about, look it up, or just wait for it to happen in front of your eyes, because everything I do is on camera, except for the one episode, or actually, I think two episodes. The one where I just... Okay, actually, there was... Alright, we're gonna try this again, except for a couple of instances where, one, I wanted to raise up Charmander's level so I could get a Charmeleon before I took on Brock, which just made sense, that way he's stronger. I did some of the raising off camera because it's extremely repetitive, and I didn't think you guys really would want to watch that, so I did that off camera. There was also a couple of episodes that were lost due to recording malfunctions, or me screwing up, or something, so then I, I either took the next episode to recap, or I just told you about it and continued on like it never happened, even though it did, obviously. So that's happened a couple of times, and then I think that was it. There might have been another time where I was, oh, I was trying to catch Abra and I ended up doing that off camera. Which I could have done on camera because it only took me two Pokemon encounters, and then I, I found the Abra. So, you know, it, it's life. You just roll with it. It's, it's a let's play. I show you pretty much everything that happens on camera. If there's anything you want me to do, like next time I raise up a Pokemon, if you want to see that on camera, let me know in the comment section down below. That way I know what you guys want to see. Because I'm not only doing this for my own enjoyment and entertainment, but I'm also doing it for yours. If you guys don't want to watch this, then you gotta tell me what you want to see that will better this for you guys. If you want to see me do it with, I don't know, other random Pokemon, then I can do that for the next one or whatever. We're gonna use a Perilous Heal. That way Growlithe will be fine for the next battle. We've got, bam, one more right here, and then the lady in the middle is the trainer, so that will end up being in the next episode. I will not even try to push it into this one. Execute. Is Execute still grass, or is it... No, I think it's... When it's Executor, it is Psychic in grass. So this should be a grass Pokemon still. So Ember should work effectively. It is super effective. <laughs> I was right. Ooh, and burned it. Solid. Hypnosis, and you miss because it's got 55 accuracy. But it is a really effective attack, especially if you have it on a Haunter or a Gengar. You use Hypnosis and then Dream Eater, and the Pokemon can't do anything because they're asleep, and all you keep doing is knocking off HP for days. Alright, so I know I said I'm putting the Gym Leader in the next episode, so let's go head out to the Poke Center, heal up, I'll go... I don't know, I'll probably go to the store, or I can, ooh, I know what I can do. I can go get the coin case, which is in one of these buildings here, because I need the coin case for that Pokemon that I want to get. Is it this building? I don't think it's this one. No, this is a hotel, but they're full. And what's going on here? One of these is the restaurant. No, that's, that's another guy that I don't need to talk to as of right now. Here it is, and it's this guy in the back. Right over here, he has got the coin case. Go ahead, laugh. I'm flat out busted. No slots for me. I'm going wherever. Here, I won't need this anymore. I got the coin case, so I can store all of my coinage in there. Actually, I actually want to go talk to that other guy, because I think he might have been Mr. Fiji or Fuji or whatever. Because he is going to end up at the top of the Poggy Tower. He he he, the slots. Nope, not that guy. That's a bad guy. That's a stupid Team Rocket guy. So we're going to go heal up here real fast. And then, uh, I don't know, I might go into the Superstore. Or we'll call it an episode a little early, or I don't know, guys. What do you want me to do? I think you guys want me to continue and get this to 10 minutes long. Right? That's why you're here. Sure. So we are going to head over to the... Walking around all over the place. Actually, even better idea. Let's go give the guard his tea. How about that? That way I can open up all the guard lines. And that way I can show you what to do. See, try to walk forward. Oh, that tea, it looks awfully tasty. Huh, can I have this drink? Gee, thanks. Glug, glug, glug. Gulp. 
If you want to go to Saffron City, you can go right on through. I'll share this tea with all the others. So guys, that's going to bring it to the end of this episode. I will see you all next time. Have a great day, everybody. Bye bye all right guys click the video on the left to take you to the previous video click my speed drawing and the 3d question mark on the right to take you to a random video and as always be sure to hit the big red button down below to subscribe